What is happening everybody? Welcome to Terrier Owner, the channel where we do everything related to Terriers in general, but specifically Jack Russell Terriers. This is Luna, my little over one year old Jack Russell Terrier. Relax, it's okay. She's being a little shy on the camera. But today we want to go over one specific thing, which is how to trim these long fingernails. You might catch my son pop into these videos every now and then as well. Um, but yeah, we'll get to that here next. Stick around for just a second. All right, guys, we're back here, and I want to go over this video kind of as efficiently as we can, but the whole point is just to cover the basics of... Hold on, bub. Let me do this here. Sorry about that, guys, but go over the basics of how to trim your Jack Russell's nails. Um, one of the key things to remember is that you're not always going to have to. If they get enough exercise where they're out on asphalt or cement, they'll kind of file themselves down naturally. She does get out quite a bit on walks, um, and she's out here in the backyard quite a bit, which is a mixture of cement and grass, but she still needs hers trimmed about every four to six weeks. To do it, I'm just using these Bachelle nail clippers here. They work awesome. She's pretty comfortable with them. We've done it a few times already. You can get them on Amazon, I think, for 20 bucks, maybe a little bit less, but for how easy and smooth these cut, I would highly recommend them. But biggest thing to keep in mind, and I'll get her a little closer to the camera here, is there's really not much to it. All you need to do is make sure that you don't hit those vein lines or those nerves, which are pink underneath the nail. You can see it super easily if you're in pretty good lighting. That's why I just do it outside like this. But let's go through this here real quick. As long as you have decent control over, which I usually have her on a lead, but she got it tangled up, probably because she knew I was making this video then they'll sit pretty still for you. Just go above that pink line when you do it, and they clip just like that. That's how smooth these clippers are. Just go through all the nails. She's trying to eat it right now, being crazy because she knows she's on video. Roan, say hi. Hi. He'll be in a lot of the videos on this channel, guys, which we're gonna do a video every week. And make sure you, while we're on that topic, like and subscribe to the channel. Um, she's young. I waited. Hold on, bub. I waited until she was um, closer to 12 to 14 months old before I started really getting involved on the videos here, mainly because these dogs do take a little bit of time to calm down. So it would have just made me look like an idiot shooting it before that, before she was trained. But we'll do. We'll cover everything. We'll do training tips, uh, potty training, clicker training, walking, um, disciplining. A lot of people will get these dogs for hunting and other outdoor activities like that or even swimming. So we'll cover tons of stuff. We'll have fun videos in here. Again, just make sure you like, subscribe, hit that notification button down below, um, and you'll get all of the tips, especially if you just adopted one of these guys so that you can get a head start on all the stuff, just like this nail trimming here. But yeah, I, just in the matter of those two minutes on this video, I've put three of her nails. This is gonna be number four here. I'm just staying short, trimming them down. That's one done except for the dew claw there. Now she wants to be a little bit pushed back on me here. Six, seven, eight. And then you got the back ones, but again, whoa. These guys like to jump too, in case you guys haven't watched that. We'll do a video on that. Yeah, they do like to jump. They're pretty jumpy, aren't they? She's about 10 pounds, since this is one of the first videos she's in. I figured you guys could meet her here. She is a technically a tricolor, but only two color, two colors really come out in her, which is obviously your, your brown and your white. Um, I got her from a breeder in my state. She's been awesome. Rowan, do you like Luna? She's okay, huh? We'll keep her, I guess. We'll keep you for a little while. Uh, these dogs are, they love you, affectionate. They do jump. They have... They're hyper, but uh, overall, guys, this, this nail trim and stuff, it, it's easy. Um, you just want to have a little bit of control over them. We stop bouncing that? And you want to make sure that they're comfortable with it and you have good lighting. That's the biggest keys I have for you. Keep up with it so you don't run into any snagging, like it getting caught in any kind of carpet 
furniture because if they do snap one of those nails off or you cut it too short I mean it's gonna bleed and it's gonna hurt um, I haven't had that issue with her but I've owned dogs my entire life and it does happen happens to everybody it, especially if you've never trimmed a dog's nails and if you have bad lighting you you can easily hit one of those nerves so Luna and I will see you on the next video and Rowan of course which is my son um, in case you're hesitating to get one of these dogs and you have young kids, I think he's a good example that it works out just fine. Um, they're crazy together. They hang out. As soon as I let her go here so that she's off the video, I would almost bet money she's going to dart right over and play with him. Let's see if I'm right before I let you guys go. But again, like, subscribe, hit that notification button, and we'll see you guys on the next video. Luna, go get Rowan. Go get him. Go get Rowan. Call for her. Yell for her. Yell for Luna. Yell for Luna. Yeah. Okay. <laughs>